Hi guys, today I'll be showing you how to make a cleaning station for your airbrush. It's not necessary, I mean you can spray it into anything really when you're cleaning out your airbrush, but um, there's no need to buy one either, uh, it's a pretty simple gadget to, to, to make. Um, makes life easier, keeps your mess to a minimum and we'll be using just a jar that was left over from uh, some coffee a plastic bottle and you'll need some kind of tube or um, I actually found this plastic uh, connector, hose connector um, which will probably do the trick fine um, the idea is to have something where your airbrush goes into so when you're cleaning it the paint goes into or the cleaner and the paint goes into the jar you could use a rubber hose anything really will do I had this little one as well which fits quite well um, but I'd have to cut that one at an angle because you don't want to be cleaning your airbrush facing down uh, so I'll probably end up using this one uh, not sure yet because this one is already at an angle so and it's slightly larger so I can clean out my mini uh, spray gun as well so we might be going with that one so the first thing we're going to do is we're going to just cut the top off right there because uh, that's what we actually need uh, off the bottle okay now you could just make a hole in the bottle and spray your your stuff in there but plastic bottle is light it will fall over etc something like this will actually be more sturdy so let's go ahead and just cut that just get the lid off I actually took the ring off there as well so that will hopefully go flush onto the bottle there okay and that will be our filter okay we'll drill some little holes in there We'll just poke some little holes in there and that will act as our filter case um, so now we just need to mark out on our lid where we want things to go so we'll want our lid somewhere here and that somewhere over there actually we might go for the small one cut the holes out now I'm actually going to use the smaller piece because it's just going to look tidier and take up less space I've checked my fitment it works with the, with my mini spray gun so and I'm going to try and set it <coughs> at an angle okay and now the, the top will go in there it's a bit tight but that's a good thing because it will just hold better okay so just pop that in and and then glue it um, we'll glue it with some there we go it's perfect now I'll just use some glue on that one um, to hold it and then a little bit of silicone or something there so it holds in place okay, okay now while we're waiting for that to dry we'll just poke some holes in the lid
I just put some silicone around there keep that in place and prevent any leaks so that's gonna dry out and we'll do the trick this one here I actually left alone because it is very snug so I'm quite happy with that and then <clears throat> for a filter we're just going to use a little bit of cloth we'll just put the cloth around there tighten that and we'll be good to go Okay. as you can see now we, we're just using water based paints so this is going to be fine this will do the trick um, if you if you're using urethanes then this is not a very good idea because you know you'll still be breathing in whatever vapors come out uh, this is just to keep everything tidy and your uh, leftovers all in the jar and then you can dispose of them properly so yeah that works out fine I can trim that because that will last a while and there we go that's what it looks like in the end so just spray in there, clean it out in there as you can see I got a good fit there so just clean out your brush everything goes in the jar no mess so I hope you guys like that um, it's a cheap idea you know use what you've got and Catch you later.